All right, here we go again. Dan at Big Apple Music. Yes, it's another side-by-side, -side, and in the words of DJ Khaled, another one. This is a 22 Polaris Ranger. This is a North Star Ultimate. This particular buggy has the factory ride command in the dash. It did come with factory front and rear speakers, and I'll show you what they look like from the factory. So the front speakers go in the dash, and they look like this. And they have a smaller speaker in there. I believe it's a 5-inch. Not, don't get a whole lot of sound out of it, but that's what they come from the factory. The rear speakers, this is the grill, this is the speaker, but you can see it's very shallow, you're not going to get a lot of output out of it. So these are the grills that go that used to go in the back. Well, to give the customer more sound and give them what they wanted, we went ahead and we came up with a design where we went ahead and mimicked, you can see right here, that's the factory, here's the aftermarket. We went ahead and mimicked the same design bevels chamfers all that stuff did a nice chunky grill on it the reason for the chunk grill one it gives it a more rugged look plus these are rgb lighted so you can go ahead and get a better look of the speaker inside and i'll show you that in a second here you go again you can see on the passenger side again it is a little taller and the reason why is you have a depth issue on the roofs on these but it does fit the speaker now went ahead and did the same concept in the front went ahead and designed and prototyped a front lower mount now in the past you may have seen I just did a bracket um, that has a speaker and it's exposed with a grill but this we wanted to give it more of a factory OEM look. Uh, so this right here again all the 45s on the side you can see over there contours into the dash contours into the dash. Now we did do RGB lighting on this last setting I had was on blue and the reason why is this vehicle or this buggy comes with factory blue accents in it so this way you can see the lights real nice so you can see it while it's going down the trail top switch is for the RGB lighting bottom switches are on the trail jump pack turn the switch on you hear that click it turns the isolator on so you don't have to worry about being uh, having no battery on the trail went ahead and did the um, JL base knob right here in the dash uh, we used to put them down here bottom but we I moved it up here just because it's a more natural uh, spot for you uh, while you're driving um, it's just you don't have to fumble and reach around for it so that's your base knob this particular rig has two amplifiers in it. In this, we did a JL Motorsports, the MX301, which runs a single 10W1 in a custom sealed enclosure, and the MX284, and that runs your four Clarion 6.5 uh, Power Sports RGB lighted speakers. Below the amplifiers on the ABS amp rack is uh, the spare battery and isolator, so they're all hidden away. Once this is down, again, you don't know anything's in here come around the other side and we'll show you the subwoofer enclosure subwoofer enclosures right here um, it's nice tight fits away um, it has a single tan that fires backwards and then it is slot ported out of the bottom so it gives you a real nice output um, and yeah that's about it honestly a little change on what we've done in the past but this right here gives you a nice factory look, loud trail rig that anybody can enjoy. So on the next one, which is coming in in a second, because I'm pulling this one out and pulling in another one. Uh, once again, Dan from Big Apple Music, give us a call uh, to get your buggy uh, scheduled.